It's the 51st year that Goliath is serving Thanksgiving brunch. Organizers say this year is different. Yes, it's outdoors because of COVID-19, but what's also different, the number of new faces of people in need. Gly's George Gundry says the first meal they serve is big. It feels good to be taking care of our community, doing something um, for our folks that they wouldn't be able to get anywhere else. Kimberly Brown wasn't the first in line, but this is the first Thanksgiving that she and her daughter are homeless. Having a traditional dinner prepared for us in a really beautiful environment was, was really what the spirit of giving is all about. Nice job, Carver. This year, because of the pandemic, Food is being prepared inside, boxed up, and then served outdoors. I feel like mutual aid and mutual support is crucial, and this is one way to show it. The least we can do volunteering a few hours. Andrea Zamora lives in Oakland. She's here because she wants to make sure that people's basic needs are met, like having food to eat. Eat, that's something crucial. Everyone should be able to eat, especially like on during times like this is very tough economically and with everything going on, pandemic. Among the crowd of people are new faces. Glide organizers say that's another big change brought on by the pandemic. We're starting to see faces that we haven't seen before and they're probably people in San Francisco and maybe even in other counties that just can't make ends meet and they're coming to us to get the help that they need. More than 2,000 meals will be served, including 200 box lunches that will be delivered to homeless encampments around the city. In San Francisco, Ansar Hassan, ABC 7 News.